Hi, I'm Jane Esselstyn. I'm Ann Esselstyn. And today we're cooking a dressing out of our cookbook, Be, Be a Plant-Based plant -based Woman, woman warrior. warrior. And the dressing we're making is called baritone. I don't even know what baritone sounds like. Is it high or low, middle? Tell me where the baritone lives. Um, it lives low? Yeah. Baritone. I can't do it. Baritone dressing. I tried to have like an ascot on today, <clears throat> like I was protecting my baritone voice, but I, I don't think I know. Am I banging my microphone? Sorry. Um, it's called the baritone dressing. It's on page 97 and it's quick to make and it's so delicious. Uh, this, you can see this book is war warped here because I go to this dressing often. I mean, majority of the time. All the time. I'm actually doubling it today. So hopefully you're following along because the numbers we're using are not the same as the book. So, um, we're going to put in some warm water. And you can use any kind of nut butter. If, you've, if you um, have, want to use tahini or if you want to use almond butter. I haven't ever made it with peanut butter, but I think it would be okay. Um, peanut butter to me is more of a, I don't know. I don't think of it as a, um, oh, thank you. It's kind of desserty, and it's a little bit of a main dish that's rich. And if salad dressing, I guess I would like it. I should probably try it sometime. Anyway, um, and after the water and the... Not of choice. You're going to add a quarter teaspoon. Sorry. You're going to add some um, miso. And I want to make sure I have a quarter cup of miso, which I do. Miso paste is, whoa! Ah! Miso paste is this wonderful, it's fermented soybeans. Do you know much about miso, Mommy? No. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's, it's very... It's really, it, g it gives you that fermented bit of food that is so important for everybody to eat. Yes, and we're not and cooking this. A so it's saltiness. And it doesn't seem to affect blood pressure. And all these studies done, Dr. Michael Greger had a whole video on it on nutritionfacts.org if you're interested. But miso has a salty flavor taste to, uh, and it adds a nice mouthfeel, but it does not uh, ha seem to affect blood pressure, which is just a bonus. Okay, so where are we? We're, um, we're going to add g minced up garlic and did an amazing job with garlic. And Two tablespoons of rice vinegar. I forgot the rice vinegar. So this is the <laughs> minced garlic Goodness. that took me a long time to mince. And believe it or not, I thought I'd really done a good job. And guess what? Jane reminced my oh. excellent mincing. I but did I? Yes. Well, you know what? Maybe I just saw a chunk because it was it was actually really well done. And so then we're gonna add rice vinegar and stir that up. Thank you. So we have rice vinegar, then we're going to add a little bit of maple syrup. One, two. I had a friend who wrote me and she took a picture of a recipe and she said, I like this without the maple syrup. And it wasn't this recipe. It was a different recipe that didn't have maple syrup in it. And I think she meant this one. So I think she tried this one without the maple syrup. If you're interested to give it a try, try that. Um, and then we're going to add some tamari. So this is a savory recipe if you haven't picked up on that already. And then a little teeny bit. Um, and then hot sauce of choice. And sriracha has been out. Sriracha, I guess the... I got sriracha through Amazon. I ordered it. You did? I did. Um, I can't get it in the grocery anymore. I'm just going to do like one, two... Ooh. That's probably close to a quarter teaspoon. I think it's just a, um, oh, it's one to two teaspoons. Let's go a little more. Okay, that's, I don't want to go too hot because I love this so much. And you have the option of putting a um, finely sliced up scallion in here or green onion, if that's what you want. I'm going to put this on our salad here so I don't feel like I need to put greens in the dressing. If you're going to use this as a dip for things, I would put something green in here to, because that green draws people to it. Anything that has green in it looks a little more fresh. That's why you see things garnished so beautifully all over the internet and whatnot. If you hear something groaning in the background, it's our dog. He loves this dressing so much. I think he wants to have some too. <laughs> um, all right, so let's dress this and give it a go. And I, I have doubled this because a lot of this is going to go. Actually, I should just show people how I store it. I put it. <laughs> Frazier, what are you moaning about over there? He's just moaning up a storm. <laughs> okay. We like to store our vinegars, or sorry, our dressings. dressings. Sorry. 
You know when your baby's crying, those of you who are parents, you might know this, if your baby's crying, you you can't help it. It's your it's your stress. It's your brand of stress. You have to take care of it. I feel like my dog moaning for some reason is distracting me like it's my stress. All right, we want every Oh, that's the pointy end. Why don't you use the other? All right. No, no. You can you can use whatever end you wish. What is that, do you think? We don't know. All right, we've got some dirty Oh, <laughs> Fraser. <laughs> Here, when you do that, get that, all that. Thank you. We should just put it in the salad bowl rather than. In we here. should have just put the salad in here. You, you know, know what? what? Just Let's just do that. Ta da! That's a brilliant thing and to do. And then move it back. No, we can. Okay, so. And in our salad here, we just have some tomatoes and some little orange peppers. And a few blueberries. And some blueberries. We love to get some vitamin C in our dress. Okay, so I'm going to add a little bit of this, this to the scene. And it's so wonderful at the end of the day to go to the refrigerator and see extra dressing waiting. Or even a dress salad that you may have left over waiting. All right, this looks so good. Let's get our forks out. Wade, you ready to try some? Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Do you like tomatoes? Whatever you give me in there. All right. Now the key thing Some on people tomato don't like... is you've got to cut them in half. Oh, I love having them whole. Wow. That's a... That's a big bite. That's a big bite. <laughs> <laughs> Taste the dressing. That's what we're looking for feedback on. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Mm, that's a lot of dressing. It's so good. I overdressed that, but I can't get enough of it. Sorry if it's too strong, you guys. Is it too strong? That's great. I don't know what's happening to my dog. If you hear this high-pitched noise, it's him wanting something. Um, okay, well, this is our baritone, and our, my dog is singing from his baritone <laughs> voice. This is lot. definitely baritone day here. <laughs> All right, well, I'm going to keep... Is this my fork? Oh, no, that's the... <laughs> That's the tossing fork. fork. All right, I think we're like, let's just have this for lunch. <laughs> you think? Okay. I think. Well, cheers. Let us know how you enjoy your baritone. Thank you. Bye. Bye.